The time just after leaving school is when young people face a lot of change in their lives. We talked to three people about how their lives have changed and their plans for the future. My name is Reza and I'm a lawyer. I work in Boston at a large law firm downtown. In college I was a political science major and after college I went to Washington DC to work in politics. I worked on Capitol Hill for about two years, which is where the government is, and it's also the center of the city. Working in government, I learned more about the law, and I wanted to get more education in the law. I decided I wanted to come back home and go to law school in Boston. When I graduated, I had a job ready for me, and I started to work right away at the firm. Uh, the stress level now is a lot different than when I was in law school. In law school, you're stressing about your academics when you're practicing law as a lawyer, you're worried about doing the best job you can on those projects that you're working on for your clients. For the future, I, I hope to have a wife. I hope to have uh, a family, kids, um, and I hope to uh, love the work that I'm doing and to be excited about it every day that I wake up. Yes, it's Kim Kalunian from The Warwick Beacon. I'm just fine, how are you? I am a freelance reporter for The Warwick Beacon. The Warwick Beacon is a small newspaper located in my hometown, Warwick, Rhode Island. I actually got into this business by accident. In high school, we had to do an internship. I was interested in theater, so I approached the editor of The Beacon and asked if I could do some theater reviews. He accepted me as an intern, but he wanted me to write about everything. After I finished my internship, my editor offered me a position as a freelance reporter, and I immediately accepted the offer. I was really lucky to get the job, but I'm a freelancer, so I'm responsible for discovering my own news. In the future, I hope to write for a larger publication that's more widely read. I'd really love to interview someone famous, like the President of the United States. <laughs> My name is Robert. I went to school at Tufts University in Boston, Massachusetts. I majored in English and philosophy because I'm a student of how people think. I do improv comedy and I make people laugh uh, three or four times a week. Improv is short for improvisation, where people make up things without any preparation. When a show starts, we'll ask an audience member for a suggestion. Uh, maybe we'll ask, what's your favorite food? And they might say spaghetti. And from there, we'll think of something funny to do using the input of spaghetti. I started taking classes in comedy after graduating from Tufts, and now I know enough comedy that I teach people. Pass that focus and concentration all the way around the circle. Good, make that eye contact, make it crisp. I'm much happier now than when I was in college because I found something that really makes me happy. Good, all right, good. Five years from now, I would love to be working on a TV show in Hollywood or performing on a major stage in New York or Chicago. Reza, Kim, and Robert have all made plans for their careers and future lives. Let's hope that their plans and your plans are a great success. <laughs>